10 tips and tricks nobody knows. If you like the video, then share it with your friends. Tip number one. Today I'm going to teach you the undefeatable right peak. Improve your close range fight ability. Watch the video carefully. Let's take a look at these few clips from my perspective. Not just in one position. It can be done in any position and very easy to learn. Let me explain this trick for you. Come to the training ground. Find a cover to practice any right position. The first thing is not to focus where the enemy is. Pay attention to where he comes out. Because your opponent needs to move towards his left side position and your right side position. Otherwise, don't use this trick. Now back your head to avoid headshot after he came out. Or just do crouching back. Just like this. You can ask your friend to accompany you in this trick to practice. Tip number two. When you attack the house, enemy on the stairs often surprises us like this. Learn this new trick. It is known as backward door technique. Pull the joystick backward when jumping. Easy to surprise the enemy on the stairs. First, let me explain you. Door having flat ground like this can be easily climb. But this kind of door with stairs is different because there is a height difference. That's why we can't climb the door. But backwards jump can perfectly solve this problem. Jump like this. Let me show you some examples. Using this trick, we can go up to the second floor without using any stairs. It is very easy to master. You can apply this trick. Every house where there is a door, surprise your enemy. School apartment's house door can be easily climbed like this. Tip number three. Want to improve your aim and accuracy? Then watch this. The first step is to come to the training ground. Press the gun in front of this line. Don't pull too fast at the beginning of practice. Otherwise, it won't work. The slower the gun, the higher the difficulty. Practice like this. practice for about 10 minutes every day and after this you'll feel like your gun controlling is becoming more accurate the second step is to come to this training mode try to lock the aim to the target if you don't find it difficult try from long distance to increase the difficulty for training practice for about 15 minutes every day tip number four when enemy push towards you like this I think many of you throw grenade like this. Learn this new trick. Share with friends. Instead of throwing grenade, learn this new trick. Use stun grenade. Just throw the stun grenade at 30 degree. This will make enemy blind and deaf for a few seconds. Let's take a look at the enemy's perspective. Whether the enemy is one or four, it will blind them all for a few seconds. Take advantage of this and surprise the enemy. Tip number five. Do you always throw grenade like this? Enemy behind the cover will not get knocked. The reason, when you throw the grenade, it will bounce the grenade five meters away from the position. And if you throw it from a high ground, it will bounce even further away. That's why the enemy survive. We need to throw the grenade three to five meters back from the enemy position so that it will bounce the grenade back to the enemy. In this way, you can accurately knock the enemy. Enemy point of view. And in such case, where grenade cannot be bounced over, we need to throw the grenade when there is one second left.
depends on the distance of the enemy. Let's say the enemy is 30 meters away from you. You need to throw the grenade when there is two seconds left. Same as previous, you need to throw the grenade when there is two seconds left. Tip number six. I believe that many people go to the training ground and practice the recoil. The recoil is very stable, but when it comes to actual combat, it becomes very difficult to control the recoil and think that there is a problem with my sensitivity. In fact, it's not a sensitivity issue. Your practicing training method is not right. So today, I am going to teach everyone how to practice pressing the gun correctly. The first step is to open the scope to aim and lock the position, because the correct way to press the gun is first open the scope and aim, and then fire. This will make the gun more stable. It will also help us to get familiar with our ADS sensitivity. It make it easy to aim at enemy. The second step is that you have to check whether the recoil of your gun is going up and down, or left and right. If it's going up and down, you need to practice controlling vertical recoil. If it's going left and right, you need to practice controlling horizontal recoil. Training method for controlling vertical recoil? Find a target about 100 meters away. No any other attachment except mag. Press 40 rounds of bullets at once. The purpose is to let you master the recoil and pressure of 40 rounds of bullets. But in actual combat, you don't need to press all the 40 rounds of bullets. But you must be able to control the 40 rounds of bullets. Practice for 10 minutes every day. Training method for controlling horizontal recoil? Hit these target at the training ground. Do left and right pulling training in sequence. Helps in real combat when the enemy moves left and right. The purpose is to increase your control over the horizontal recoil of the gun. It's better to practice for 10 minutes every day. Tip number seven. When you attack the house, have you ever been attacked from the other side like this? Another enemy comes from somewhere else and kills you. If you have any such problem, then watch this video. Be sure to follow these steps with your teammates to learn the attacking strategies. First, seal both of these windows. Throw Molotov directly at the ceiling. Let's see the enemy perspective. The purpose of both these two fires is to seal the both small and half room. Now the remaining enemy can only be in half room or hide behind a wooden box. Now before you attack the house, all you need to do is throw a stun grenade towards the corner of the stairs. After throwing stun grenade, you can directly push to the enemy. First, let's look at the effect of stun grenade. Whether your enemy is camping or hiding behind a box, the stun grenade will blind them all. Blinds the enemy for a few seconds. If you are sure the enemy is in the small room, just throw a bounce stun at this angle. Enemy will be blind for a few seconds. No matter where he face, the trick for this house is also the same. Throw Molotov directly at the window and balcony ceiling at the same time. The purpose is to block the enemy shot from balcony and the other one is to seal the small room. Now you only need to throw a bounce stun at my position. No matters where your enemy is in the room. Even if he's facing the other side, it will blind the enemy. Same just like previous, bounce the stun grenade. It will flash the room. Same goes to the other small room. Throw stun at my position. Bounce directly into the room. Blind enemy for a few seconds. Tip number eight. When you take close range fight, can't keep up with the gun, feels like the enemy is moving too fast. If so, then please watch this video carefully. First of all, we need to know that our character will have this teleportation thing when changing direction. Do you understand? So let me explain to you again. Basically, when you change your direction, our character will also move, like this target in the training ground. This explain why every time you fight at close range, you always miss the target. Solution? The solution to this problem is very simple. Come to the training ground, treat this target as the enemy and practice. When enemy change the direction, 
Quickly move the gun with the thumb or gyroscope. Tip number nine. Do you always do like this? And get killed whenever you attack the enemy. There is a method that can allow you to dodge the bullets. And the reaction speed is also very fast. And the body position will also leak very small. Do you want to learn it or not? First, open the scope in advance. Second, pull out the scope and crouch and shoot. And also remember to pull it back the scope. Repeat the same steps until the enemy is knocked out. In the eyes of the enemy, you will only visible for a second. Tip number 10. Subscribe for more videos.